What's up guys, Retro Gamer Steve back with another video and tonight's video is going to be a small pickups video. Um, I haven't gotten, uh, actually I haven't gotten anything in. Um, I have gone to a few local stores around here and picked up a few things. So not a big video, no home runs today, but still some worthwhile pickups. So um, I hope you guys enjoy and let's get into it. All right, guys, so the first pickup I'm going to show you guys is the Super Smash Bros. Isabel Amiibo. Um, they have this at Best Buy, Target, basically at a lot of the stores right now. Um, I picked this up two days ago, and uh, I think I paid $15 or $16 for this. And at the time when I purchased this, this was actually going for um, or worth $44. Uh, that has since dropped down to, I think, $26 in the last two days. So I guess there's a lot of people finding these, finding these out there. But um, I do already have Isabel for the um, Animal Crossing Amiibo. Uh, two different versions of her, actually. But I did not have the Super Smash Bros. version of Isabel. So I went ahead and picked her up. do always enjoy adding amiibos. Then I picked up some 3DS games. Um, I picked up all of these for fairly cheap. Um, yeah, these were mostly, well, the first three are all Walmart finds. Um, Lego Marvel's Avengers. This is a sealed copy for the 3DS, obviously. And I paid seven bucks for this at Walmart. So if you guys are interested, um, I've been telling you guys for weeks that Mar or not Marvel, sorry, Walmart has been clearing out a lot of their games and um, selling them for really cheap. Switch games, 3DS games, Wii games, Wii U games. Um, so anytime I can find a brand new 3DS game for seven bucks, uh, I'm gonna buy it all day long. So I picked that up from Walmart. Then I also picked this up from Walmart, and that is Yokai Watch 2, Bony Spirits. Uh, I do have Yokai Watch. Um, there are, I believe, two other Yokai Watch 2s. One of them is Fleshy Souls, and I uh, forgot what the Spirits one is called. But um, So I do have the first one, and I have one of the second one now. And this one comes with an exclusive metal inside. That is also compatible with a yokai watch, which I didn't have any idea was even a thing until I picked this game up. Um, so I do have the first two yokai watches now, and this is a sealed copy that I got from Walmart for cheap as well. And then these next two games I purchased at Best Buy. And these were also cheap. The first one is the Nintendo Selects Super Mario Maker uh, for the 3DS. I paid $11 for this, brand new. So, really happy to have this finally. This is actually my first copy of Mario Maker for any console. So, um, I'll honestly probably just keep this one sealed. But for $11, I had to pick it up. So, if you guys are looking to pick this game up for cheap... Um, Best Buy, 11 bucks. Go grab one. And the last 3DS game I picked up was also from Best Buy and also for $11. And that is Kirby's Extra Epic Yarn. And again, this is a brand new sealed copy. And everywhere else that I go to, this game is still going for $25 to $30 brand new. And... I paid $11 for this at Best Buy. So again, guys, if you are looking for this game and there's a Best Buy near you, um, they might have a copy, they might not, but if they do, it's $11 right now. They also have Super Smash Brothers for the 3DS brand new for $11 as well. But I already have a copy of that game, so I left that one behind for the next collector. I did pick up one Switch game, and that is 
Friday the 13th, the game. This is the ultimate slasher edition that includes the all of the DLC, a limited edition poster, and clothing and costume packs, emote pack. Um, I did open this game up because I've honestly been wanting to play this game since uh, day one. And I have been playing this the last couple of nights and just having a lot of fun with this game. I will show you the poster for it really quick. It's pretty cool. It says uh, Friday the 13th, the game there. There's Jason. And then it says hide at the bottom. Really cool looking poster. So I thought that was a pretty cool um, add-on for the game there. And uh, my girlfriend got me um, the um, Nintendo, uh, a, a 12 months of Nintendo Online. So um, now I'm finally using the uh, online capabilities and this is the first game I've played online for the Nintendo Switch. And this game is a lot of fun so far. I'm really having a lot of fun with this. So I'm glad I finally picked this up. And um, yeah, if you guys have not played this game and you are a fan of this uh, series, um, check this out. It's a lot of fun for multiplayer especially. And the last thing I have to show you guys is something that my good buddy War Train Wins had on a video, pickups video. Gosh, this has been a few months back, I believe. Um, as I was leaving Best Buy with those two pickups, and oh, actually I got all three of these here uh, at Best Buy. Um, at, behind the counter, they had only one copy of this, and I had to pick it up. So that is the collector's edition of Ori and the Will of the Wisps for the Xbox One. Just an absolutely beautiful game. This is sealed, and I will probably keep this sealed. I think I'm going to look for a loose copy so that I can play because this game looks amazing, and my girlfriend really wants to play it as well. But the graphics and art style and the music uh, is just awesome. So, um, yeah, I have not yet played this. I have seen a lot of gameplay footage. Like I said, my buddy War Train wins. Did a, I uh, believe he did a video um, on gameplay of this. It could have just been part of a pickups video. I can't remember. But this does come with a steelbook case, the game, an art book, um, the piano collections, music CD, and original soundtrack MP3 download, which I don't know who uses MP3s anymore these days, but whatever. But yeah, I had to pick this up. It was the uh, only copy of this game that I have seen probably since the first couple of weeks that it was released and um i just you know had to bring this home so those are my pickups for this week guys all right guys well i hope you enjoyed the pickups video um if you did and you're not yet a subscriber think about subscribing to my channel guys and hit that thumbs up for me that really helps small channels like mine grow and gain traction and if you did like this video and you like content like this, do yourselves a favor and check out these channels right here. These content creators are amazing. They're all friends of mine. They have just awesome videos, video game related stuff, uh, pop culture related stuff, um, just great channels. So do yourselves a favor and go check them out. And um, if you did enjoy this video, guys, come back Monday for my handheld game of the week video. And until then, have a happy 4th of July weekend, stay safe, and keep gaming.